kids workshopping a new song and we wanted to use that expression of uh, the phrase together we can my name is Joe Guy and I'm an Aboriginal uh, Torres Strait Islander I come from far north Queensland and uh, my Aboriginal side is Kukwemiji my um, islander side is Coral Rick. I've um, been a musician and singer-songwriter for about 40 years now. And Ruth, do you want to just tell us a bit who you are? I'm Ruth Rosper Eyre. I'm a music educator and um, I'm a fiddle player in the Awesome Joe Guy event. <laughs> <laughs> just with one note. The Children's March is actually just the next stage in an ongoing campaign which is about trying to be more respectful and to think of the earth not as a resource but as something that we need to find some other solution in terms of living. The music and the, the art is a way of claiming the, the issue more directly. It's like time that you've put into this issue apart from the going to the march. It's a level of affirmation but also investment. Susie Watson, our amazing art teacher, did a heart project and the children got to design their own heart. They line all the school fences and it's whatever the, the, the children felt was their message that they thought represented the school. Jo was here doing an incursion yep. and saw out the front of the school there's a beautiful one that said, together we can, and it really resonated yeah. with you, didn't it? Yeah. That's what it is. After my class, I drove away and I sort of looked back and I said, oh yeah, you know, that's, that's that song there. They can create something there, you know. Yeah. It belongs to that school and, and it, it can kick off. Um, that, it, that everything belongs to the students and get those students to input um, something like we've done with, with all these writing. Yeah. And um, they've come up with something really, really groovy. Yeah, you know, it's Together amazing. we can. The whole thing about the song is that it is a way of joining your voice to the voices of others. It's lending volume, it's lending harmony, it's naturally building something that's inspiring and interesting and, and effective. So I think it's really interesting the way that children are taking up this form of action again and how they do it and they want to do it because it's important for them to feel connected to other children and feel connected to um, a mass of people. Hi, I'm Parker. I'm standing here to make some changes. I'm going around now to see people's behaviours. I'm a climate fighter to change the world. So listen now. 
boys and girls. People are dying, the world is frying, trees fall down, the world is brown, the air is polluted, my voice will not be muted. We chop down trees to just make money. The government sits back and thinks it's all funny. You can't live off the money they make. You can't eat it or put it in a cake. The next generation, we're the ones they'll be hating. We have to act now, there's no point in faking. Soon all the rivers will be muddy and brown. The human race, it's falling down. The world is evolving. Problems need solving. How will you go down in history? Eco warrior, it's still a mystery. The glacier are going. Danger is flowing. I'm a climate fighter to change the world. So listen now, boys and girls. I know it seems hard to do your part, but we can save the world. It's time to start. Wake up, people. The time is now. Do you really need a 10-year-old to show you how?